stories that I covered last year include the Thai cave rescue, the elections in Cambodia, the plight of the Rohingya who have fled Myanmar, the Congo, uh, we did several stories there, the aftermath of the Kasai War and also sex slaves in the Kasai region. Also the plight of Syrian refugees, uh, myself and Michael Bachelard went to Jordan, Lebanon, Iraq and Turkey and talked to Syrian refugees about their experiences and, and how they're being cared for. And then the fall of the Caliphate, myself and David Rowe went to Syria where we covered the aftermath of, of the fall of this caliphate. I think the importance of photojournalism is that we capture things that words can't. We can capture the emotion of a situation. We can bring to life a situation or an event that is so different from ours at home. And and we can bring empathy or, or evoke emotion, sometimes that words just don't have a place for. They're very long days, but they're, they're full of fascinating and intriguing and sometimes heart-wrenching and heartbreaking situations. You're meeting people a lot of the time on the worst day of their life. And so it can be very emotional, it can be very hard sometimes, uh, but at the same time, it's incredibly rewarding and I think it's very important 